welcome to another vlog folks we are down here at the track uh, for another Tuesday beginner session just had a huge package or well, huge packages come in from GK Tech uh, we got that massive um, package there as well as all of this stuff here for the Adam LZ car um, so I might do a little bit of unboxing this afternoon uh, to see all the cool stuff from GK Tech um, I got some wheels back finally. Um, I let someone borrow a set of wheels here. He ended up um, bending one of them and been about a year and a half, but he finally had them repaired and got them back to me. Other than that, we do have the beginner session on tonight. Um, so looking forward to that. See how many people rock up. We've had heaps and heaps of beginners rocking up lately. So we are excited for that. Yes. 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 Um, and then some people have been asking what the progress is so far with the V35. Absolutely none. I am waiting for the body shop to be able to take it away and get their recorder panel fixed. And I am waiting for um, all the bits from GK Tech on back order for the V35 and 350Z because you guys have probably been ordering so much of it so they don't have any more V35 uh, or 350Z stuff in stock. So i got to wait a little bit just for some bits for that, but this car is getting the uh, dual caliper um, GK Tech uh, handbrake kit, exactly the same as what's in my 350Z. Uh, it's also getting the lock knuckles, and hopefully, 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 Shockworks will get me my suspension for my 350Z soon. So no pressure, Chris, but I could really do with that good coilover suspension for the 350Z, so I can put the not as good suspension in the V35. Um, and hopefully, 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 Scarlett will eventually finish drawing the design. When are you going to finish the design, Scar? Next week. Next week? Yeah. Are you sure? You don't want to do it sooner? No. No? Huh? no. You know Daddy's waiting for you. Everybody's waiting for you to finish the design, Scarlett. Oh. Yeah. So the, we, I can show everybody? Yeah, because once you've finished it, we can put it on the car. I told you we'd do with that. And then obviously, being a Tuesday or just being a time down at the track, it wouldn't be the track without Cheech without a shirt on. <laughs> uh, Cheech has been over swapping some tyres and stuff like that. I need to get these tyres over to Blackheart to... And the jumping castle. And I've got to set up the jumping castle for the kids, but I do need to get these wheels and tyres across to the guys at Black Arts to get them all stripped down and I'll put them back into storage and leave, only ever really leave a few of them out. Alright. Also, while I'm thinking about it guys, if anybody is after some four stud, uh, I think 18 by 9.5, or they might be 18 by 10, pretty damn good offset wheels for S13. Um, these wheels are for sale. Uh, preferably looking for smaller wheels for that car uh, because two tones need small wheels as far as I'm concerned um, so if anyone's interested they got tires and all that sort of stuff um, let me know in the comments or hit me up on Facebook or whatever all right let's have a look in these big ass boxes of GK Tech stuff and see what we've got inside it's my unboxing Zach down at GK Tech doing the damn good job on the wrapping. Rear, rear Canuck. I'm guessing that means rear knuckles. Ooh, wee. Look at that. Now, YouTube, that's a how to, I'm guessing. That's heavy. Oh, it's a whole set of rear knuckles, I imagine. Yeah, lucky it's been night. Oh, oh, nearly wrecked the sticker. I don't want to wreck the sticker. Dad. Yeah. Why did you say this is a sour? Hmm? Why did you say this is a sour? It's not. All right. Ooh, GK Tech rear Canucks. Mm-mm-mm. Speciali. What's this? 
Oh, that's all the bolts and stuff for it. Lots of fluffy stuff. All right, we won't take them out of there. We'll probably leave it in there. Oh, what's in this box? More mag stickers. Oh, rear LCAs. Can I have a sticker? You want a sticker? What's yeah. this YouTube thing? So rear LCAs. Shanky things. I'm not going to pull them out. We're just looking at it all. Do you like it? Look good? I take some Little boxes. With little boxes. Oh, spaces. Woohoo. Slippy, slippy boy spaces. Slip on ones. Yeah, we're going to use them to get some offsets happening with those big ass wheels. So they're good. They go with the cheap tech spaces. What are they? These are the... So uh, you, you didn't know about these? Well, you knew yeah. about them, but you just haven't seen them before. Yeah, I just haven't seen them. The ones that you uh, gives you extra length, and then you just cut it down to whatever length you need it. Yeah, it was just cool. They fit all the S, Z, and R chassis. Um, all of them. And they're pretty good priced. For, yeah, they're cheap. You know, compared to a standard tight rod. Hmm. Is that the end of that battle? Well, there's more. There's more box in this box, or is it a box stuck to the box? That's a box stuck to the... What the hell? What is this box doing? It's a box stuck to the box. <laughs> GK Tech got mad skills. Oh. Oh. She wants to come for a drive. More goodies. Oh. Are these more spaces? No, they are... Tired ends. ends. Andy boys. Yeah, tired ends. Oh, with little, um... The things that make them go down further. Oh, these are cool. These are the um, strut top things for the knuckles. So that is the oh, top. Oh, yeah. That's the top, so you get like extra camber and all that sort of stuff. Oh, so you can offset the top of the coil over. Yep. Yeah, Which that's is very mad. cool. That's nice. Pretty... Nice. I'll tell you what, there's a lot of them. Really? Yes. We're not. Oh. Or rapid boy. Yes, we are not. Beautiful. They're 1.25. Does it say? Yeah, 1.25. Awesome. Perfect. They'll go straight on to the 180. Another tie rod. What's that? Rear traction? Rear traction arms, I'm guessing. Yeah. Right, no, um, are these a version one? Ooh. Where's my 19 mil soccer that you're going to get me? Oh, uh, are they version 4s? Yeah. Well, hmm? Version 4? Yeah, they're the new boys. Oh, very nice. Very nice. Mm -hmm. What's this? Rear uh, camera. Rear cam? Oh, yeah, because S13, of course. Yeah, I haven't looked at S13 stuff in a while. That's why. It's obviously S13. And these are for low boys as well, because they've got the... On an angle. Ooh, kinky boy. Yeah. I think we'll make this lower than um, Adam has his car over there. <laughs> Way cool. Yes. And what are we looking at now? Oh. Oh, this is the SR catch can setup. Yes. So this is definitely oh, something over the rad one. Over the rad one. Yeah. yeah. So we definitely want that to go in Adam's car. That's going to look super neat. They're really neat, huh? They're such a good design. And they come with everything to go straight in. Sick. These rear toe arms, I'm guessing. Rear toe? Oh, actually, no. They are. Yeah, they are, aren't they? Yeah. They yeah, they are. Traction arms, aren't they? Yep. Traction rods. Traction yep. rods, that's the ones. Vlog in here, can't shut the fuck. Whoop. Oh. Foamy bits. <laughs> Front knucks. Front, Front knuckles. Oh, oh pretty. I've got the same in my S13 convertible, and I like him a lot. Solid? Yeah. Like, it's light, but it's solid. Mm. You're a good advocate. Ooh. People try. Oh, what a big box you have. Jesus. These are the Oh, Magic yes. Happens. Yeah, these are sick. Look at that, that is pure goodness. It's nice, eh? It's nice, plenty of clearance. It's got the lock, lock stops, stops and everything. Ooh! All the good bits. 
A massive jigsaw for us to put together. Yeah, it's it only take a couple of hours. Nah. Okay. No, it takes a bit longer. <laughs> you reckon? Yeah, because you've got to set, you got to essentially, essentially set everything. all your lengths and everything like that first and then go from there sort of thing. The GK Tech just... All right, so the drifting has started. There's nothing beats that first smell, does it? That first, like, session or first drift at the start of the day, at the start of a drift event, when you get that first whiff of rubber. rubber, It's just too good. I love it. Even to this day, all the drifting I do and everything, you still get that, like, that buzz when you smell rubber for the first time. So many cars tonight, too. We got another one turning up just now, R33 whole bunch of cars out there already so these beginner nights are definitely going well so thank you to the guys that are supporting this event um we're loving it we're having such a good time putting it on and we'll continue to do so while the demand's there all right so we're going to give a hand with a bit of car set up here yeah it looks like shock works yeah shock works Mid. so how old are you just standing is the bolt on the top or is it underneath underneath so you're going to jack it up Got turbo beams and an 8.6 Fresh. Yeah, this yeah is just amazing. turn lock. Yeah, no, it's a wicked car. Yeah, it's fun. Same guy built this that originally built mine. Oh. Yeah. This is so responsive. No clutch kicks. Yeah. Let's go. R thirty one wagon and this super rad eight six. We have a guy from overseas. Where did you say you're from again? I'm from Denmark. From Denmark. That's what we want. From Denmark in our rental S13. So he's mostly used to driving left-hand drive, but he's out here driving one of our one of our cars. He's doing a pretty good job. So yeah, packed tonight again on these beginner nights. They've been absolutely killing it, eh? These beginner nights have been wild. Oh, you're loving it because it's your car. Yeah, it's my car and he drives it better than me. <laughs> yeah, that 8.6 is super rad. It's a turbo beams. those wheels we're gonna to have to talk about that <laughs> for AG32 the V8 some fresh tires you did. did oh did you wreck it last time yeah I missed it wrecked it <laughs> <Got a new cousin>. <laughs> <laughs> uh, not 33 it's all happening cool Sylvia nice the drag wing 31 Matt the your guts fell off sick with these nights going good it just makes you feel good about drifting just a couple of Commodores it's one way to get started oh, a bit of commie action what's up YouTube <laughs> Nervous, Cheech. Yeah, it's my car out there. Finally <laughs> <laughs> letting the sun have a drive. Yeah. yeah. Alright, this thing seems to be happening a lot lately. I keep forgetting to film outros and stuff like that. Just been very busy with the kids and everything. Kids ended up getting really cold last night, so I ended up leaving Archerfield early. Um, so I didn't get a chance to have a drive myself, which I did so much driving on the weekend. I really wasn't 100% keen to have a drive anyway. And when we do the uh, beginner layout, we do a nice slow course. So I didn't want to, it was so busy. I didn't want to get in anyone's way anyway. Um, so we came home early with the kids 
and basically got them bath and had a good night with those guys and um, yeah, didn't get a chance to shoot much more, but still plenty of interesting stuff there. Super stoked to get Adam LZ's 180SX back from paint and get started on putting all of that GK Tech gear inside the car. Um, and really excited to get the rest of the stuff for the V35. I'm dying to get the V35 finished, but as you saw Scarlett in the video there, it's not really a priority for her because she likes doing her smaller pictures and things like that. So I don't know what I'm going to do there. We may have to go to the Atasha design if she doesn't um, sort of do it in the next year. Um, anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching. Uh, no drifting in this one, but we'll see what I get up to today because it is now Wednesday morning. So we're going to see what we get up to today. Um, I do have heaps to do. I've got so much to do, but... It's all good. We've got a massive comp this weekend as well, guys. If you're in the vicinity of Archerfield or Brisbane, head down to Archerfield Drift Park. We've got the Queensland State Series Round 2 on. Um, so come down and check that out. Anyway, if you enjoy it, guys, please share it. Otherwise, like, comment, subscribe, let me know what you think, and we'll see you guys in tomorrow's vlog. Bye. Mm -hmm.